Welcome to Z Tutorials and today we are looking at a viewer request in Dreamweaver on how to center a web page. Now they obviously had some problems with this and I'm going to show you a quick way to center a web page which is probably the easiest way around. Now I just created a quick web page here which has a div ID called header and an image inside it. Um, in my style document I just have it squeezed with height and width. Now as you can see all it is is an image with a div and when we preview in the browser this is what it looks like. It's off to the left and there's a gap on the top and the left with a white space. It just doesn't look very good. Now we want to center this page. That's first priority. You should always do that just at the start. So what you want to go do is you want to go to your header div or whatever div you have. Maybe yours is called wrapper. You just want to put in margin left auto and margin right auto. Now it's very very easy. Dreamweaver brings up the text automatically so you won't misspell anything. You close that auto with a semicolon. Now the margin left is going to push it in automatically and the margin right is going to push it in automatically. Basically it's going to center your web page on all browsers so that it will be centered on every single browser and it won't look different on each browser. So now this is what we have. It's centered. It looks very very good but we still have that white gap on the top. Now to get rid of this white gap is very very easy and a lot of people think that doing it this way is the right way which is wrong. They go ahead and they put in margin top minus something pixels and they guess how much pixels they should minus off it to get rid of the white space until it's wrong and it looks different in every browser. There's a simple and easy way to fix it and it's called the body tag. Now the body tag isn't a div, it's just what comes with every single document and there's no hash sign or pound sign or period sign before it. it's just body which are two curling brackets inside that you just put margin and you put it to zero and then when you preview that in the browser there we have it's gone so this is what we did we got a web page that was set off to the left had a big gap in the middle then we go centered and then we go centered without any gaps at the top and it just looks very very good so that's it for today I hope you guys liked it it was a nice quick tip and I hope you guys like these quick tips because I'm thinking of doing a lot of them. If you have a little request to do, I will do a few. Just send me a private message or leave a comment below. Thank you guys for watching and if this helped you, make sure you subscribe for more tutorials. This is Z Tutorials signing out.